Did you know that a single drop of your blood holds millions of tiny cells that reveal secrets about your health? Complete blood count. What is a complete blood count, CBC? A complete blood count, CBC, is a routine blood test that measures different components of the blood. It is used to assess overall health, detect disorders, and monitor medical conditions. The test provides information about red blood cells, RBCS, white blood cells, WBCS, platelets, hemoglobin, and hematocrit levels. It helps in diagnosing anemia, infections, blood disorders, and even cancers like leukemia. Components of CBC and their significance 1. Red blood cells, RBCs, oxygen transporters, function, RBCs, carry oxygen from the lungs to the body and remove carbon dioxide. The hemoglobin in RBCs binds oxygen and gives blood its red color. Normal range, men, 4.7 to 6.1 million cells per microliter of blood. Women, 4.2 to 5.4 million cells per microliter of blood. Children, 4.1 to 5.5 million cells per microliter. Abnormal levels, low RBC count, can indicate anemia, blood loss, bone marrow problems, or chronic diseases. High RBC count may suggest dehydration, lung disease, heart disease, or polycythemia vera. 2. Hemoglobin, Hb or Hgb, oxygen carrier, function. Hemoglobin is a protein in RBCs that binds to oxygen for transport. Normal range, men, 13.8 to 17.2 grams per deciliter. Women, 12.1 to 15.1 grams per deciliter. Children, 11.0 to 16.0 grams per deciliter. Abnormal levels, low hemoglobin, indicates anemia, blood loss, or nutritional deficiencies. Iron, vitamin B12, folic acid. High hemoglobin, may be due to dehydration, lung disease, smoking, or high altitude adaptation. 3. Hematocrit, HCT, blood volume percentage. Function, hematocrit measures the percentage of blood volume occupied by RBCs. Normal range, men, 40.7%, to 50.3%, women, 36.1% to 44.3%, children, 32% to 44%. Abnormal levels, low hematocrit, suggests anemia, blood loss, or overhydration. High hematocrit may indicate dehydration, lung disease, or polycythemia. 4. White blood cells, WBCs, immune system defenders, function, WBCs fight infections, inflammation, and foreign invaders. Normal range, 4,500 to 11,000 white blood cells per microliter of blood. Abnormal levels, high WBC count, leukocytosis, suggests infection, inflammation, stress, leukemia, or immune disorders. Low WBC count, leukopenia, may indicate bone marrow disorders, viral infections, autoimmune diseases, or chemotherapy effects. 5. Platelets, PLT, clotting agents. Function, platelets help in blood clotting and prevent excessive bleeding. Normal range, 150,000 to 450,000 platelets per microliter of blood. Abnormal levels, low platelets, thrombocytopenia, can cause excessive bleeding and bruising, often due to bone marrow disorders, infections, or medications. High platelets, thrombocytosis, may increase the risk of blood clots, leading to strokes or heart attacks. Additional parameters in CBC1. Mean corpuscular volume, MCVRBC size function, measures the average size of red blood cells. Normal range, 80 to 100 femtoliters, FL, high MCV, indicates macrocytic anemia caused by vitamin B12 or folic acid deficiency. Low MCV suggests microcytic anemia due to iron deficiency or thalassemia. 2. Mean corpuscular hemoglobin, MCH, hemoglobin per RBC, normal range, 27 to 33 picograms, PG per cell high. 
MCH, seen in macrocytic anemia. Low MCH, found in microcytic anemia. 3. Mean corpuscular hemoglobin concentration, MCHC, hemoglobin concentration in RBCs. Normal range, 32 to 36 grams per deciliter. Low MCHC, seen in iron deficiency anemia. High MCHC may indicate spherocytosis, a rare RBC disorder. 4. Red cell distribution width, IRDW, RBC size variation. Normal range, 11.5%, 14.5%, high RDW, suggests anemia or vitamin deficiencies. Why is CBC important? A CBC is a vital diagnostic tool used for detecting anemia, infections, and blood disorders, monitoring chronic conditions like leukemia and autoimmune diseases, assessing overall health during routine checkups, evaluating the effectiveness of treatments like chemotherapy or iron supplements. When should you get a CBC test? Your doctor may recommend a CBC if you experience fatigue or weakness. Frequent infections, unexplained bleeding or bruising, chronic inflammation or fever, monitoring of medical conditions, e.g. anemia, leukemia, infections, etc. Conclusion A complete blood count, CBC, is a simple but powerful blood test that provides critical information about your red blood cells, white blood cells, platelets, and overall health. It helps diagnose various conditions, from anemia and infections to serious blood disorders. If your doctor recommends a CBC, it's an essential step in understanding your health.